Hello, beautiful people. It's Mineral Monday, and we got Tiger's Eye. Tiger's Eye. So when I first started meditating with this, I can see a pyramid at the base of my spine, and that's my root chakra. So it was allowing my foundation to be stable and kind of pointing up, moving up towards my body. And then it kind of went into my mind because my mind was trying to take my emotions that I've been feeling lately and amplifying them. So it could, my mind really would take my emotion and make it a tidal wave when I need to ground that emotion and make it a, a low tide ocean kind of feel instead of allowing my emotions to take over and override my decision making. So this stone is going to help balance your mind and your emotions, grounding them. And then it's going to allow you to build the strength and courage to take action without the anxiety and without your emotions overriding your decisions. So it's going to really help you with decision making. So if you're in business, this is a really go good stone to have. Um, it's also known for spiritual protection. It's just a really earthy, lovely stone. So it's working with your root chakra, your sacral chakra, which is your connection to all life force, your life force energy, your sexual energy, your creative energy. Um, and it's kind of like that gut feeling. And when you have that gut feeling, your emotions kind of come up. And if your emotions bring up that tidal wave, it's going to be very hard for you to make the correct decision based off that a massive amount of emotion, emotional energy coming through. So this stone is going to help balance that. And then when I first started collecting stones, I didn't really understand or know that they had different colors for each stone or for several stones. So I had a dream that I was in the desert and I put my hand into the sand and lifted up my hand to allow the sand to fall from my hand. And what came from that was a blue tiger's eye. So I'm like, if there's a blue tiger's eye, oh my God, I need it because I love blue and I just didn't know that there was different colors of different stones. So I looked it up and of course, it says blue tiger's eye can be found in the desert. So I'm like, wow, like my intuition was kind of spot on with that. And then, so I was on the search for it. I go to the crystal store and I'm like, hey, do you have any blue tiger's eye? And she's like, I don't think that exists. And then I look down and I see this and I'm like, well, what's that? And she's like, oh my God, that's blue tiger's eye. That's crazy. <laughs> so this stone is going to help ground your voice and ground your intuition so that you can speak up the truth. So it's kind of doing the same thing. It's kind of calming your mind, easing your emotions, but then easing your emotions to speak up. So even though it's blue tiger's eye, it's slightly different from the brown tiger's eye. So if this is kind of more of a un or more of a common stone now. So if you have one, please enjoy and gather your strength with this stone. It's gorgeous, lovely, earthy energy. So enjoy. Talk soon.